Hey guys, so I really didn't plan on doing a voiceover. Um, if I sound like I don't remember what I'm talking about or doing in this video, it's probably because I really don't remember. So starting off, I prime my face with the Benefit Professional Primer. This is just a little sample size that I got from uh, uh, a client. And I am also using the Too Faced Lip Injection Balm and something barely nude like that just to plump up my top lip a little bit starting with the eyes i already have my foundation on and i really don't like it because it makes me look super red like it's completely off and it's one of those black radiance uh foundations i just can't get with it i've been trying to use it and you know get my little coin worked out of it but it's just not working so taking peanut butter i'm going straight into the crease and I'm just basically deepening my crease. I wish I had a darker brown shadow, but I didn't and I didn't feel like moving. So yeah, just taking that color. Or is this truffled? I think this is truffled, not peanut butter. Next, taking the black shade in the semi-sweet chocolate bar palette, going um, in my crease a little bit more just to give it some dimension. Basically deepening it again. Next for my lid, this is a Urban Decay um, eyeshadow pencil or liner or something like that. I believe they're like $24 a piece. So you know I did not buy this. <laughs> this was actually a gift from one of those, you know, birthday gift things from Ulta. And it has, well it is a dark purple but it has a lot of shimmer in it. A lot of black shimmer in it so I decided to go ahead and try it since I totally forgot I have it. Next, after blending that shadow stick out with my finger, I'm taking the Ben Nye Glitter Glue and some glitter I got from Hobby Lobby. Literally, this is the only glitter I use is from Hobby Lobby. And I'm placing that right on top of um, the area I use that shadow stick, right on top of my lid. Please, please, every time I use this glitter glue, I try to warn you guys, do not get this in your eyeball. It will burn like hell. And I say it burns more than any soap. It is painful. So be careful. Next, I'm taking this Scandalize or Scandal Eyes Mascara. It was like $1.47 at Target. I guess it's discontinued, but I really love it. Especially because the wand reminds me of the Benefit uh, Mascara. So I really like it. It's kind of like a dupe. After applying my mascara, I'm going to go in with these Vegas Nail Lashes. This is the Grand Glamour version. Also taking that same um, shadow stick pencil, I'm going to use that as my liner for my lash line. Next to highlight, I'm mixing Maybelline's Medium Fit Me Concealer and also my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer, I believe this is. And this is in the color NC45 and I'm just mixing that together i'm really not going to go too detailed with the highlighting and contouring part just because i have a updated video on that and i'll link that below but just doing some basic highlighting and contouring and i almost forgot to contour so that's why it looks a little backwards right here but i'm just using my la girl pro concealer in i believe it was mahogany and to set my highlighting um, areas I just use the Kobe Airspun to set my dark areas. I use the NYX palette, the dual palette, the wine and dine version. And to set my entire face, I'm using the NYX no filter powder. And I probably shouldn't use this one because it also is too red for me, but again, I did not feel like moving. For my highlight, I am using. Um, Milani Tantastic Illuminator. I believe the number is 001. At first, when I got this, I wasn't impressed, but after using it um, several times, and I've had this for months and months, I basically, this is my go-to highlighter. Like, it just gives the best glow. Next, to set my face, I'm just using my Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray. Nothing too heavy because I'm basically going to wash this off in a minute. <laughs> 
And my absolute favorite liquid lipstick, this is Guess by ColourPop. It's this deep plum purple vampy lip. It's just awesome. And thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video.